hemophilia, royal disease. Hemophilia is a rare blood condition where people do not have the clotting factor which enables their blood to clot when bleeding. It's an inherited disease that's usually passed from mother to son. It's also a disease that's been prevalent in European royal families. People in ancient times wrote about blood and bleeding problems. They could see that some people bleed differently, but they knew very little about how blood clots. It was not until just before World War II that doctors learned that Haemophilia A was caused by a problem with a protein in the blood, later called Factor VIII. Eleven other blood factors were recognized in 1950s. They were given Roman numeral names in 1961 to avoid confusion. Why is Haemophilia called a royal disease? Haemophilia has been called a royal disease. This is because the Haemophilia gene was passed from Queen Victoria. She was a carrier of Haemophilia B and passed the disease on to three of her children. Prince Leopard died from a post-accident hemorrhage when he was 30, but the two daughters who inherited the mutant, Princess Alice and Princess Beatrice, went on to marry royalty in other European countries. Queen Victoria's other daughter, Alice, was a haemophilia carrier and her son died from a disease in early childhood. One of her daughters, Irene, married Prince Henry of Prussia and passed the gene to the German royal family. She gave birth to two sons, one who died at the age of four and the other died at 56. Alice had a carrier daughter, Alex. She became Empress Alexandra at a marriage to Russia Tsar Nicholas in 1894. Their son, born in 1904 and named Alexei, inherited haemophilia from his mother. The young man, Alexei, was treated for bleeds by the mysterious Rasputin, known as a holy man with the power to heal. Unfortunately, all the Tsar and Tsarina's children were killed during the Russian Revolution, so the mutant gene was stopped in its tracks. Queen Victoria's granddaughter, Victoria Eugene, who was the daughter of Princess Beatrice, took the disease to Spain when she married King Alfonso XIII. The couple went to have five children, one daughter, a carrier whose children did not inherit the disease, and four sons, two sons who had haemophilia. Both the sons with haemophilia died without having children. Haemophilia today No living member of the present or past reigning dynasties of Europe is known to have symptoms of haemophilia or is believed to carry the gene for it. The last descendant of Victoria known to have the disease was Infant Gonzalo, born in 1914. Although hundreds of descendants of Queen Victoria's, including male descendant, only through females, have been born since 1914. However, because the haemophilia gene usually remains hidden in females who only inherit the gene from one parent, and female descendants of Victoria have left many descendants in royal and noble families, there remains a small chance that disease could appear again, especially among the female line Spanish descendants of Princess Beatrice. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something new. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe our channel, What's Up Genius.